Hello there. We can get straight into it again. I've sort of abandoned Destiny for a couple of days, because it's one of those games for me where I sort of play it for a little while, and then I forget why I play it. So... So yeah, we're going to get straight back into it, we're going to go straight back onto the campaign, because it's still, still part way through the campaign. I build crafting evolved. Ooh, there you go. Um, no. Alright, what have we got? Quests. No time left. So, uh, yeah, look at that. 75 days left. So, yeah, still roughly, um, fairly new to it. Which is cool. So, yeah, so... I guess it's another Neptune thing, isn't it? Back door. Oh, my. 1790. Okay. Ugh, Eververse. Actually, I haven't looked at the Eververse. And I'm not going to. Fuck the Eververse. Uh. Yeah, no worries, man. Alright, what do we got? Arc damage, void, single life, submachine guns. Oh, yeah, I can do those. Cool. Alright. Been playing a lot of Borderlands, so. Gotta re. re remember all of the keybinds. Destiny's usually pretty easy to pick up anyway, so we should be okay. Should be okay. Hmm, every time I see that, it reminds me of Warframe. So, at the time of recording, I think it's Hildren Prime for Warframe, for the, um, the new Prime. Uh, the Prime variant. When they do Wisp Prime, I'll be back. I enjoyed Wisp really, really well. Like, really good. Because I like being the support class. Ooh, chest. I'm gonna get that chest. Oh, no. No, sir. I do not wish to play. It's uh, coming right for me. Hey, look at that. Did you see that? I think my graphics card's on the way out. All right. Mind you, I've been murdering my gravity card with um, Stable Diffusion, playing with AI and pictures and stuff. I can do some really wicked things. Callus encroaches upon the veil. The activation of the radial mast is imminent. The veil is compromised. The Amuna will fall. Then all of Zul will follow. Strand will be our edge against Kallus. The Guardian is ready to wield it. I think. Rohan and I are with you. This is our city. The Shadow Legion are honorless cowards. They shall share Kallus's grave.
So it doesn't imply that these guys in green are wielding the strand. Or is that just... Is that just, um... Coinky dink. There's nothing up there. Yep, there we are. Sweet. That's the submachine gun thingy done. Ooh. Sweet. Look within. Strand super to destroy the suppression field. Your training's prepared you for this. Strand flows through you as it flows through everything. Dismiss, go away. Oh, I missed it. Okay, cool. That open that up for me. I love this gun so much. It's like painting a picture with gore. Oh, here we go. Do they still drop umbral stuff? Whoa, look at that. That's a big tank. Jesus. That's right, I was doing my cryo stuff. I see beyond. Do I now? Break this thing, don't I? The landing zone's clear. What were these uh, Terran toys you mentioned? Oh, really? You stole those schematics from my files, didn't you? Information wants to be free. I remember doing this in uh, Shadowkeep. Like. Okay, that music's pretty banging. to get out so I can pick up that loot. Yeah, doesn't really matter, does it? Ah, oh, sweet. Okay.
I don't mind the music. The music's actually really good. Could be a little bit harder. But I mean, it is Destiny style, isn't it? It's got to have that um, orchestral tone. Imagine a Mick Gordon remix of this. Ah, oh, that's a spawn point, I think. I'm going to assume it is. Thought it was going to be like a repair pad, but no. But yeah, what I was complaining about before, I was complain about everything. Um, I don't like these tank uh, missions. I think it takes away from the game. Uh, the Shadow Keep one was terrible. Um, but I mean, they had one in the Cabal original game that you can't play anymore because Bungie said, you know, even though you paid for it, you can't have it. Are they going to do an exposition flip where, where uh, Rohan starts behaving like Osiris and Osiris is trying to be chill now because, you know, he knows the way because he did the whole thing with the Strand. Doggies. No, oh, yeah, I just ran over him. Haha. <laughs> Reversed. Pyramid Goliath. Well, you ain't shit, bitch. Get out? Nope, I can't. Well, I mean, I don't know what I don't know what I expected. I tried to get out of it, wouldn't let me. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. But yeah, I don't I don't like I don't like this. So you need to die. Colossus. Above me? Yeah, it must be. Sweet, sweet. Destroy the suppressors. Oh, here we go. Where's his health bar? You can fucking swear at me or you want your little shit. I'm going to kill you. Told you. Piece of shit. 
Like, I like them. They're actually a really good enemy design, even though that I've, um, you know, been obliterated by um, one or two of them a couple of times. But to be fair, that was my own stupid fucking fault because I decided to launch a rocket launcher right in front of me um, and smash myself in the face with it. So, you know. Oh, that's right. Let's go use a grenade. Strand doesn't have grenades. This is one of those tailored missions because I've got the super already. Again, I don't mind those. They're pretty good. I guess this is all just more um, practice and shit, isn't it? We need a tank again. Yeah. That's a fire extinguisher. Oh, HS. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, yeah, come on. There we go. So, it's rude to sneak up like that. Oh, that's what I heard. Slayer. Well, I do be doing that. Uh, I'm going to need a new ride. Um, see? No? You? No? I can't get out. Uh, it won't let me out. At all. So that's fun. Thank you, Bungie. Very cool. I don't have to play with the buttons. Die again. B, no, C, no, B, no, Q. No, I can't get out. I'm starting to get really angry now. I'm starting to get really fucking angry now. How the fuck are you meant to get out of the tank if you can't get out? Maybe I'm just too fucking stupid for this game. Alright. So. F? No. R? No. E. Holding down E does that. Q? No. Z? No. X? No. C? No. V? Nope. Space? Space. 
It worked then. I don't know, they might put the pity system on me now. If you died too many times, you're not going to make the story, and we need your money, so we need you to win, so we're going to let you win now. Wait. So. Fuck off. Hey, it worked. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh my god. Fuck this game, man. This is why I hate tank sections. Why do you waste your time? And your talent on a fucking tank section. No, this light bearer cannot fucking handle this. It's infuriating. It's good XP though. I assume, I don't know. Hopefully there's no diminishing returns on it. Bungie's like, oh no, you're having too much fun farming XP, we can't let you do that. Is this just a gauntlet part? Or am I just meant to stay here forever? Out. Yeah, the game would, the game would not suffer if you didn't put this shit in it. This doesn't add anything to the game at all. Because when, like, I just, why? Why do I need to be in a tank? I'm supposed to be a light wielding fucking maniac that can't die. You put me in a tank. Restrict my weapons. Yeah. Come on. See, this is just, this is stupid. This is so stupid. For what? This way's a dead end. Oh, for fuck's sake, are you serious? And we'll have to make our own. Oh my god. What was the point? Like honestly, what was the point? Why did I, why did there have to be a tank section? I hate tank sections so much. Such a waste of your time, Bungie. Destiny 2 is a first person shooter. Now sit in this tank and shoot shit. If the radio mast links with the veil, it's all over. You and Rohan are our only hope. 
Yeah, whatever, man. I didn't even know I had to go up here. I just felt like the right thing to do. Knock, knock. Oh. Uh, here we go again. Oh, up. Ooh. Is that it? The radio mass. It's activating. I'll buy you some time, light bearer. Be careful, Rohan. Even you can only deter it for so long. That looks like a pyramid thing. A way to destroy it. Oh, it's got him. Guardian. As long as I can hold the line, the radio mass can't create the link. Find a way to destroy it. Hurry! Play the gauntlet level, and then get strand, become god, and then kill everything, and happy ending, and etc. gonna distract myself with some ads for now while I try and bring my, ran my way around again. Can't see his health bar. Am I doing damage to him? Am I doing enough damage to him? Oh sir, you do not know what you say. Uh, apparently the strand is down here. Oh, hello. Whoa. One moment, please. There it is. This of course it has to be hidden. We're we gonna go change the landscape outside. I was going to finish him. Nope, not going to happen. Alright, so suppressing... Wasn't sure if that was going to work or not because there's so many things around. Now I'm gonna die. I need to use a fucking tank, don't I? Why? 
I fucking hate the tanks. Why did they do this? Why do they put this shit in this game? Fucking hell. I don't want to play with your tanks. Can't see his health bar. I don't know where I'm up to. There we go. Alright. Take out some of these fuckers. He's going to be invincible. Because we can't find good progressive uh, boss mechanics. So we just make invincible targets. Because that's supposed to be raising the difficulty. Because we have no imagination. We can't think of anything else that we can use. Getting angry now. But I mean, it's part truth. Fucking Path of Exile does it. It's like, oh, we're going to make the game hard. Really? How? Oh, well, you know, our bosses have a one shot mechanic that instantly kills you. So that doesn't make it hard. That's just stupid. Oh, yeah, but like, you know, deaths mean difficulty. So it's challenging you. But no, no, it's not. Me a fatty. Alright. Wait, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. This is not the area to be having a fucking tank fight. Holy shit. Who came up with this? You're a, you're you're an idiot. This is not fun. Just they handle like fucking shit. And they instant kill the tank, because fuck you. God, if I wasn't paying attention, which I don't usually... Was this boss bar always on the bottom? I don't remember seeing it. That could be wrong, though. Again, that's my attention to detail while I'm stressed out. Oh, nice. I am aware I have other guns. It's just they're all shit at the moment. This is the only good one. And I don't think the game pauses when you swap your inventory, even though I'm in a single player area. Fuck off, you little bastard. These things are annoying. Alright. Still a suppression field. Doesn't mean we gotta do it again. Ah, oh, what? On top of me? Yeah, that's fair. Thank you. Can I finish him? I wanna finish him. No, there's another fucking phase. Okay. Oh, it's up there now. What? What the fuck was that? Of course.
look at look at the juxtaposition between the the um the art on the background. I'm sorry, I feel no, I feel nothing but anger and frustration and stress because that fight was stupid. Why would you put tank fight in such a small area? It just, uh, I don't, I mean, I don't, I don't like the tanks at the best of times. If the witness is capable of doing that, then why doesn't the witness just do it himself? The opening scene where he just sliced up all those those ships. I, yeah, maybe I'm too stupid to understand, or maybe I just don't know the law because I don't play this game as heavily as um, I'm supposed to. Uh, that was frustrating. I hate tank missions. I hate missions that have tanks in them. I do not see the point. Um, this is supposed to be a a first person shooter, yada yada yada, all that kind of whatever you want to define it as. I really don't give a shit. But I don't understand the the, the reason you have that kind of stuff in it, and especially in that very small area. And then when we had to do the last phase where we had to use strand again, and we just decided to just absorb it and blow up and kill everything, it was just like a wait, what is that it? Hmm. Yeah, see, these guns are shit. Uh, I don't know, man. Alright, where are we going? The secret is revealed. I don't really care. Hmm. Alright, what are we doing? Uh, we're going back. That's what we're doing. Uh, 
we're going to get some exposition dump and we're going to be made to feel bad, aren't we? Cool. Ugh, yuck. Season rank. Yes, 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 yes. Oh yeah, that's right. Hunts on the moon. Mm-hmm. Not even going to bother with these stupid Eververse crap. Battles are one with strength. Wars are one with brains. Lucky for all of us, you have both. Yeah. He's, ha he's happy, and now he's sad. Thanks for the drive. When we take on this job, get the Ogs and everything, the clock starts ticking. Ten years may not seem like a lot, especially to you, but it's well spent. It's worth it. I can't think of a single Strider that went before their expiration date. We've got way bigger problems right now. We need to get Neo Muna's defenses working again. I've got reports of Shadow Legion attempting to get up close and personal with the Vexnet. I have absolutely no idea why, apart from the breathtaking views this time of Axial Tilt. But we're not waiting around to find out. That sounds like a good plan, right? It's what he would have... No, that doesn't matter. You and I are going to see this through. Ready when you are. Mm-hmm. Sniper. Nice. Chest looted. Oh, it's retroactive too, which is nice. Alright. Uh, there was another thing. Yes, go away. Uh, up here, interlude. More exposition? I mean, I'm not saying it as like it's a bad thing, but... I guess it's good because, um, I know I've complained about it a lot in the past to myself when I'm playing this game, that you have no fucking idea what you're doing, where you're going, why you're doing it. You just... I just must... I, I must kill. Um, and if I have to go outside of the game and look up some stupid fucking cards on a website to understand what I'm doing, you've failed. Just outright failed. So, here we go. Seeing Nimbus right now reminds me how difficult it was to move on after my losses. My pain was always secondary. I felt that pain deeply when I lost Saint. But I channeled it into bringing him back to me. I couldn't bring Sagira back. But... Our pain is a reminder. We are still breathing, still fighting. For a moment there, I thought he was going to try and tell me that he was going to go get Sagira. With Neomono Civil News, this is Jisoo Colorado reporting. It is with a heavy heart I must report the passing of our senior Cloud Strider, Rohan perished while defending our city from Shadow Legion forces. Rohan is succeeded by the protege Nimbus. The Council has scheduled a vigil soon to pay homage to this great hero. Good night, Neomona. And good luck. Uh, uh, it's still blinking. Does that mean there's another one? No. What have you got to say? The Neo Muni are a tenacious people. Rohan met his end with honor. He'd be given funeral rites of the highest distinction had he been Cabal. The war is not over. Callus has failed in the eyes of his master. And knowing him, he's about to unleash his barbarity like a cornered war beast. I have a small problem with what she just said. How does she know that the witness is pissed off with him? Like, I, I guess it's implied because that was his objective and, it, and, he's, and he's failed it. But, like, I don't know. It's like, uh, what, everybody saw that cutscene? Like, everybody in the universe saw that cutscene? With um, the witness in Kalos? Because, I mean, what if it was a, a front? What if it was a feint? Maybe they didn't need it after all. They wanted it destroyed. We don't know. But, uh, I don't know, maybe I'm thinking too much into it. 
But, oh well. Um, I'll tell you what, we'll leave it there, because I'm not going to jump on a, another mission. I could use a hand. Oh, what have you got? Ready to take on some baddies? Oh, right. Thunderhead Bond. Done and done. So he's all happy again. It would be nice if there was some, like, consistency with it, but I mean, that, that's not really that thingy. What's this? Hypernet current campaign. Enter the Vex network and reactivate the city's defenses. Oh, it's a strike. Okay. Chest looted. Yeah, so I'll leave it there. Um... So this is the part of the game where I sort of don't usually do the strikes and I don't usually do the group content because I don't like doing it. Um, but since doing, um, since being a bit more involved and um, doing this YouTube stuff, um, it kind of doesn't affect me as much as it used to. So, um, hey, if you are you one of those people that um, I'm just burning time now looking around trying to remember what I had in here. Oh, look at that. Huh. That was my favourite gun when that was current. Um, yeah, if you're one of those people that has anxiety and all that kind of stuff when it comes to playing with people online, I totally understand. Um, I am one of those people, even though that I spent years and years and years playing World of Warcraft and I had no issues forming groups and jumping in. Um, I think it's because with this particular game, the chat is non-existent, even though there is a chat function. Um, and again, you have to go outside the game in order to organize groups and that kind of stuff. And I don't like doing that. It should be inside the game. I mean, that's why, that's why I have a keyboard and a mouse and I have communication stuff. Um, why do I have to use my phone? I don't like it. But, um, yeah, so I usually, um, jump into group content. I like the matchmaking stuff. Um, I... Much to a lot of people's uh, disgust, I have never done a Destiny raid, ever, because there's no matchmaking. I will do the, uh, I guess, I don't know if you could call them a raid, but um, like Callus's event when that was current, or um, Zer's thing that he had for a while that I think is still there. Um, actually, we have a look. I think it's still there. Eternity? Yeah, the Dares of Eternity. If it has matchmaking, I might jump into it. But like, uh, Grasp of Ar Avarice. Avarice. Um, I do that stuff on my own. Um, I never do raids. Uh, I just don't. Um, so, yeah. Maybe that's why I don't understand what's going on with the story. Because I don't do the raids and I don't see any of that kind of stuff. But, um, yeah. But, oh well. Um, I'm going to leave it there. Um, I, I've had enough of this one. Um, but yeah, in the next one, I'll probably do that strike. Um, and continue on. Continue on with the main campaign. Uh, you won't find me doing any raids. Um, unless I'm comfortable with it, which I haven't been for a very long time. Um, it's just not something I do uh, these days. Same with time. Um... Again, at the time of recording, I am still working part-time, um, stacking shelves, because there's nothing else going in this shithole of a town, and, um, I need money to live, so, yeah, good times, very fun, very much wow, happy, happy, sort of, but yeah, so, uh, we'll leave it there, um, frustration, I hate the tank missions, I'm sorry if you like the tank missions, and, um, you didn't like what I had to say and my complaining and my swearing and all that kind of stuff. Um, but yeah, I don't like tank missions in this game. I reckon they're stupid. I reckon it's a waste of time. I reckon it was a waste of development time putting that in. And that boss battle was stupid. Um, going from manipulating Strand, um, the gauntlet with all the enemies stacked around you and then being forced to run backwards to summon a tank to kill a tank and then have it immediately blow up on you. Um, in such a small area is just stupid. Um, I wouldn't have done that. I wouldn't have done that at all. So, but whatever. All good. Um, sorry for the rant. Thanks for watching. I'll uh, see you in the next one.